Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Reviews back with another video and we're taking a look at the sign-in with Apple, the new feature that Apple has introduced on iOS 13. This is really a great feature to have. You will be able to sign on any app or website using this sign in with Apple feature. It will make it way more easier for you to sign in. And of course you don't have to use like your email or your Facebook or your Twitter account to sign in on apps. You can do that with this new feature and it will do everything for you. It will hide your identity. It will hide your email. Basically it will generate emails and then just forward emails and everything from that email to your so everything will be very very secured and much easier for you to sign in on different apps using sign in with apple so in this video we're taking a look at this feature i will show you guys exactly how it works now of course this is early on and only a few apps support this new feature even though apple said that they will force all the applications to feature this new iOS 13 feature called sign in with Apple. So very, very soon you will be able to do this on all the apps from the app store. So let's go ahead and take a look at the sign in with Apple feature. So here I have an app called kayak and this app supports sign in with Apple. As you can see right here, I have other options, but of course I have here sign in with Apple and all I got to do is just tap right there and it will show me my information right here. So I can go ahead and just remove my name right there. That will be the first one. Just tap done right there to remove my name and I can go ahead and hide my email. So you can share your email or you can hide your email directly from there. And then just click the continue button and authenticate with your face ID. And once you have done that, it will continue and as easy as that, you will be logged in. So you can see that's very, very quick. So all you gotta do is just go ahead and choose whether you want to share or hide your email. And of course your name can be displayed or you can remove your name and that's it. You can go ahead and sign in on any app using sign in with Apple as easy as that. You don't have to use your Facebook account, your Twitter account, or your personal email. Sign in with Apple will do everything for you and make it way, way easier. And of course, much secure. Now to use sign in with Apple, all you gotta do is just make sure you enable two factor authentication on your iPhone. You will have to do that in order for sign in with Apple to work. Otherwise you don't have to do anything extra in order to have this feature. Now, hopefully very, very soon, all the apps will support sign in with Apple and make your life much, much easier. So that's basically it for this video, guys. Make sure you subscribe for more iOS 13 videos. This is how sign in with Apple works. I know that's really, really easy. It didn't take much effort right there to sign in on an app with the new sign in with Apple feature. So that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more. I'll see you on the next one.